hi this is yam tahar now today we are discussing about the renal calculi the renal calculi is a smooth epithelial tissue or formed by hardness of the by inorganic or uh, or organic substances like in the way the stones are formed especially three regions one is kidney gall bladder and intestine so most of the uh, coincidence the kidney uh, stones are formed like calcium gall bladder stones are formed like cholesterol or bile in intestine like uh, jejun jejunum especially hard substances do form urinary calculi is composed like substances normally urine and may be may be found in any part of urinary tract like urethra ureter or urinary bladder so it will form like calculi can be divided into simple calculi mixed calculi and foreign body calculi these are the comparative incidence of the forms of urinary lithiasis litho means stone the urinary that means urinary related bladder like uh, ureter urinary bladder these are the areas to form this litho stones litho means that stones the stones are analyzed like a pure calcium oxalate and mixed calcium oxalate in uh, various countries so yes cysteine and uric acid and also magnesium and phosphate strato what are the inhibitors and what are the promoters for the stone formation in urine inhibitors like the citrate calcium magnesium and uh, pyrophosphate with calcium zinc these are the inhibitors like uh, inhibits crystal aggregation like glycose amino glycan what are the promoter how to promote how to develop this uh, how to increase this condition bacterial infections anatomical abnormalities like a uh, uh, peptic ulcer disease and also alternate alternate like calcium oxalate transported in renal epithelium and prolonged immobilizations and increased uric acid levels the types of renal ureter stones the common stones like uh, oxalates phosphates uric acid and cysteines uncommon like xantho yellow color xanthin xanthin stones and uh, dihydro dihydroxy adenosine stones and uh, sialic acid stones matrix stones biochemical composition like a chemical composition what are they um, calcium oxalate monohydrate and calcium oxalate dihydrate calcium hydrogen phosphate and the tricalcium phosphate and magnesium ammonium hydroxide so renal filling the di- defect of uh, intrauterine like uh, intravenous uterine like ureter and kidney so most of the nodes uric acid calcium matrix calculus and sluggish the papillae blood clots and cysts here and assist on vascularization the no for bowen point xanthin cal- calculus and hydroxy adenine calculus epi under the calculus infectious due to gas forming fungal ball and tuberculoma and malcop and a hypertrophic peloma and renal pseudo tumor the oxalate stone how it is showing like picture this is a very useful picture for uh, easy and absorb to so i do uh, this image shows oxalate like calcium oxalate stones it is also called as a mulberry stone it is shaped like mulberry it covers with the sharp projections sharp projections this phosphate stone usually calcium phosphate sometimes calcium magnesium ammonium phosphate triphosphate also the stone biochemical tests for phosphate stone procedures so uric acid and u- urate stone this hard and smooth multiple yellow and red or brown cystine stones cystina it is autosomal recessive disorder usually in young young girls due to the cystinuria so actually clinical features like a Uh, kidney stones 75% renocolic serve as acute kidney stones are fixed pain dilation 
uric acid change the pictures like a hematuria that means blood in urine can fan can be fan or uh, only found in deep stick or lab pi uria mean pus in urine infection can have in pus in urine clinical features like acute obstruction of ureter like a severe colic flank pain refer to genitalia nausea vomiting maybe milk and look like a g problem my micro hematuria likely is chronic stones like disorders it tends to associate with the large or multiple stones can be little or no pain it may have impaired renal functions anemia white loss clinical risk factors occupation family history diet hydration small bowel disease like medical condition causing a hypercalcemia um, aciduria on examination acute uh, uh, like a presentation or uh, asymptomatic presentation in acute is abdomen tense rigid and tenderness present in one asymptomatic is uh, no tenderness findings are abdomen investigation uh, full blood investigation like we are estimating calcium cholesterol and cysteine organ like organ mineral and phosphate everything we can estimate in the urine and also blood kidney urinary blood x ray intravenous urogram ultrasonography or ultrasound ultra sound ct computer the tomography scan this is a thallus ureter thallus will see in anuria absence of urea management of urolithosis uro means that will condition uro litho means stones extra corporeal shock wave is trickery and intra corporeal this extra corporeal shock wave litho trickery and ureter uh, like ureter rhinoscopy like percutaneous nephrolithotomy and laparoscopic approaches to stone this is extra corporeal shock wave with the see shock waves generated under the water can travel through the through the body without any apprehensible loss of energy so when they encounter stones the changes in the density, density causes energy to be absorbed in reflected by the stone and this result in the fragmentation of the stones this is how structure this is the extra corporeal shock wave lithotripsy the procedure we are showing this you see urinary tract kidneys this is the ureter and this is the urinary bladder so absolute constant uh, like a contraindication pregnancy relative contraindication in pregnancy for the extra corporeal shock wave lithotripsy renal colic urinary obstruction infection and declining renal functions and significant hematuria what are the complication hematuria and stenosis so diet flur uh, uh, will give diet or advice or will give suggestions high fluid intake uh, restrict the salt oxalate restrict and calcium restrict so avoid uh, high calcium pure food increase citrus uh, citrus uh, fruits hypercalcemia like uh, anything like calcium products so moderate amount like a uh, moderately will take apple juice beer coffee cola high amount of coca fresh tea foods like almonds aspirin cashew nuts coconuts kernels grains palm raspberry spinach clinical significance of urinary stones these are the clinical urinary stones and crystal components and also renal stones calcium oxalate calcium hydroxide magnesium ammonia and uric acid 5% and histone investigation spontaneously crystallizations principles like stones like a preserve pre- how to prevention to prevent the water and water more over water enough to take make more than 2 liters prevent solute the overload by the low oxalate and moderate calcium intake the treatment of hypercalciuria replacement of salbutamol and citrate and manipulate ph and uric acid system plus force the water intake after the dehydration treatment more than two um, interval multiple stones of percutaneous ultrasonic lithotripsy it is uh, majority or minority majority is 80 to 85